Hi, this is Dr. Alan Mendelson from Eye Surgeons and Consultants in Hollywood, Florida. Today's topic is a simple one, but a really, really important one. There's a new product on the market, Visolta. I have never singled out a new product as far as eye medication, but this is potentially a wonder drug, so I wanted to uh, cover it in detail today. So what's the story? The story is glaucoma, what happens is, I'm going to put down the bottle for a moment, what happens is when we are born, faucet turns on, faucet makes fluid throughout our lifetime at pretty much a steady rate. That rate is about 2.5 microliters per minute. There is the drain in the sink where fluid will drain out. So fluid should be made and drain out at about the same rate, giving a certain internal pressure in the eye. Now there are several different classifications of drops that work very well to help lower the pressure. The number one most commonly prescribed medication in the United States is a family called PGAs. That stands for prostaglandin agonists. So while there's medications that turn the faucet halfway off, I'm actually gonna turn it off to conserve water. They turn the faucet halfway off. There are other medications that work at the drain in the sink, but when we speak of the drain, it's actually two components to the drainage. The main drain, like the drain in the sink, it's shaped just like a sponge. This is called the trabecular meshwork, and it's the trabecular outflow where the fluid drains out. And just as this sponge has large holes, medium-sized holes, small holes, the sponge does as well. After the fluid drains through the trabecular meshwork or the trabecular outflow, there's then a second drain area called uveoscleral. Now this trabecular outflow is much more important than the uveoscleral. Those medications, the number one prescribed, only work on this uveoscleral. So you're probably wondering, if this is more important to help the drain than the uveoscleral, why don't we use medications that affect on that part? And the reason is there are eye drops that work great. The big problem, those drops do three bad things. They're called myotics. It's drops that were used 50 years ago, 40 years ago, 30, even 20 years ago called pilocarpine. What they do is they make the pupil very, very small. In the process, People have brow ache, forehead aches, and that happens many times during the day. Worse yet, by making the pupil very small, it is decreasing the peripheral vision. So even during the daytime, things like crossing a street can become problematic. But the worst thing of all is, with the myotics making the pupil teeny tiny, at nighttime somebody loses the ability to drive to get around. So those drops work great on the drain, but for practical purposes, really, they didn't go over very well, and it's really almost like a last resort. So the beauty of this new drop called Visolta is, it works at both the trabecular outflow and the uveoscleral outflow. So the PGA agonist, the prostaglandin agonist, will decrease pressure 25 to 35%. But now having a dull mechanism working at both spots, pressure goes down even further. So some people might say, well, if the pressure is decent, does it really matter that it's going down an extra two or three millimeters of mercury? And the answer is absolutely yes. For just one millimeter of mercury decrease, many researchers feel it's a 10% decreased chance of losing peripheral vision. So again, one miller of mercury, lowering it, potentially decreases by 10% the chance of peripheral field loss. So if we're able to get 20, excuse me, two or three millimeters down, could be a 20 to 30% less chance of damage. So this new drop called Visolta, I think it's probably going to be a game changer. The last drops, the PGAs, came out in 1996. Ophthalmologists have been waiting two decades for a new product, and this has hit the market, and my prediction, it's gonna have a major impact. 
of the patients that we have switched to so far, we have had a very beautiful decrease in pressure. And the other nice thing about this drop, it's a once a day drop, that's it. And um, it works superbly. Thank you very much.